Welcome. Today we're going to discuss diversity in the workplace. A strong diversity and inclusion initiative in an organization is one of the keys to remaining competitive in our modern business world. Diversity in the workplace fosters increased creativity and innovation. Our workforce is made up of women and men from many cultures and multiple generations. Some of the workforce is also composed of those with disabilities. Due to many different economic variables, there are now five generations in the modern workplace. It is important to recognize and understand the many differences between these, including those in communication styles, motivators, and also the way each deals with authority. Let's start with Generation Z. Born from 1995 through today, they're tech savvy, and social media has always connected them to their peers. They also expect instant contact and flexibility, and they may be working in the same organizations as their parents. Generation Y, otherwise known as the Millennials, born between approximately 1980 and 1995, are a very tech-savvy generation. They're looking for a work-life balance, and they bring new creative ideas to the workplace. They prefer a casual dress code and are comfortable with an informal communication style. Generation X was born between approximately 1964 and 1980. They're also tech savvy, but they learned it later in life. They appreciate flexible schedules and enjoy a casual dress code. They value leisure and PTO time, and they're position or status focused. Baby boomers were born between approximately 1945 and 1964. They prefer a more formal communication style and a more formal dress code. They're often less tech-savvy, and they may possibly be re-entering the workforce. Traditionalists born between approximately 1927 and 1945 are more likely less tech-savvy than other generations. They prefer a more formal communication style and a more formal dress code. They may possibly be re-entering the workforce or have chosen to take a part-time job. In addition to generational differences, our workforce is also made up of people from many different cultures, educational backgrounds, and those with disabilities. It's always good to remember that although there are most certainly differences between you and your coworkers, you will also find many similarities and common ground. To learn more about diversity and inclusion training programs, please visit us at www.phrsconsulting.com or follow us on Twitter at PHRS Consulting.